Welcome to the Welding Technology Program at Highland Community College Technical Center. Today we're going to talk to Robert Atkinson about the program. Okay, when you come into the industrial welding program, the first thing you'll do is uh, take a safety course. Then we'll have a cutting class, which you'll use the uh, um, torch cutting and plasma cutting predominantly. We do teach arc gouging, but that's not used a whole lot. But uh, just about everything you're going to do, you're going to need to arc gouge uh, the plasma or the cutting torch to cut out the metal. After that, we go into the uh, different welding classes. First one would be the stick welding or shielded metal arc welding. Then after that, you'll go on to the MIG welding, which is the wire welding. And from there, you'll go on to the TIG welding, which is uh, gas tungsten arc welding. Uh, all of those will be done on plate. The whole first semester is uh, structural steel. So everything you do will be done on plate steel. You'll do it from a drawing that will be given to you when you start. After you've completed that, then you'll do a bend test, a guided bend test. And those are to test the welds for soundness, see how well they're going to perform. Uh, second semester when you come back in, it'll be predominantly pipe welding. And the pipe welding will start out the same, it'll be stick welding first, then to the MIG welding, the wire welding, and then on to the TIG welding. Uh, the pipe welding is a lot harder because you have to add another angle to it from what you'd have on the plate welding. Um, the third semester that we're going to have will be strictly pipe welding at an advanced level. Um, every level that you go into, you have to pass a comp C test to get into the next level. And then from there, uh, when you finish the third level, you should be able to get a job welding just about anywhere. Uh, paying locally is $14 to $20 an hour. Uh, if you become a pipe welder and go on the road, uh, you can make close to $100,000 a year. Uh, very few people have the ambition to go that far with it because it's the amount of commitment you have to make to it. It's a very intense training when you get up to the high levels. Anybody can learn the lower levels of welding. Basic welding is very easy to learn. It's when you get into the advanced levels it gets a lot harder. Uh, another thing that I do when I start you out is after the cutting course, we use a virtual welder that's behind me. Uh, it's a simulator, computer generated, similar to a video game. You do everything like you're supposed to and then it'll score you on the how well you did on that project. And you can try it over and over. It also has visual indicators to show you what angles you should be on. And uh, that's what I start the students out on and then we go out into the shop and start the real welding. 